Governor Mike Parson is asking the Attorney General to investigate high natural gas prices after the recent bitter cold temperatures. Our Missouri Chief Capital Bureau reporter Emily Manley joins us live now to explain whether the state can help you pay for increased electric bills. Emily. Mandy and Vic, Governor Mike Parson is warning national gas companies to not take advantage of Missourians. He's now asking the attorney general to get involved because he's concerned that there's some companies that are price gouging. It's frustrating. I'll, I'll just say that. And I can't imagine uh, what it's going to be like for sticker shock when a lot of people get their bills. Earlier this week, I told you Missourians might have to foot the bill for using extra energy, causing rolling blackouts in some parts of the state. I think every state and I think other governors are going to be looking at the same thing. We want to make sure what is the cause of this and what's the who's benefiting from this. Governor Mike Parson says with the cold temperatures, he understands the supply and demand of natural gas. I, I realize shortages of whether it's fuel, whether it's natural gas, whatever it might be. But I don't want anybody taking advantage of that either because we've only been in this for a few days and all of a sudden prices are skyrocketing before you've even eliminated, before you even eliminated the storage capacity of a lot of these companies. Warning fuel companies they will be investigated by Missouri's Attorney General. We will not tolerate any effort to price gouge or take advantage of customers at a time when there is no other choice or alternative options. Parson says there's the possibility of the state activating an emergency declaration, but wants to look into the price surges. We have those options out there to help those communities, but first of all, you got to figure out what that source was. Just because we're finding a way to pay some corporation money that's making millions and millions of dollars off of a national or a natural disaster. Parson says if anyone thinks they've been the target of price gouging, to call the attorney general's office. We do have the ability to help in some situations. Um, especially for individuals like we are. I'm not sure what's going to come down to cities and counties and when you start trying to backfill that loss. I don't know. Now, also during his press briefing today, I asked Governor Parson if he's received his COVID-19 vaccine yet since he and his wife are both eligible. He said that him and the First Lady got their first shot of the Pfizer vaccine last week, but he did mention that just like everyone else, they've had to wait on a list and they were able to get that shot last week here in Cole County. Reporting live tonight from Missouri State Capitol Bureau in Jefferson City, I'm Emily Manley, Fox 2 News.